This is I-84. No, this is I-15 South in Idaho. We are about say 50 miles from the Idaho Utah border. The temperature now is six degrees. Problem here, if you drive here at night and you assume that the road is clean, the snow is okay, you lose your life because of the wind. As you can see that looks like Wyoming. You have flat hills, the wind blows any time and the road disappears. Even though, as you see, it is clean now and the snow is powder, if you walk on the ground because of extremely cold, you're not going to find any water or slush snow. The snow is very dry, powder, crystallized. At night, I have to quit early after the sun went down. I found the hotel. But I know that in the, at night when it is dark, it's impossible to control the vehicle of this kind of condition. We are now in the first week of February. Look at this, beautiful. But this is a deadly bunch of I-15 because of the mountains are too far from the highway. So you have a hilly, flat area where the wind can blow between these hills and the entire road would be covered by a snow exactly like the place between Rollins and the Laramie in Wyoming, which is called like a death track. I-15 south of Idaho heading to Utah is not very friendly in winter, especially this doesn't last for very long. If you come here, I am coming back again in afternoon. Come here another week, in four days, most of that snow will, will be gone. I hope so. We are in February. Might last too long. The sun is beautiful outside. Look at the skies. There is not even a drop of water in the skies. Because of the extreme cold, all the clouds precipitated. The snow fell on the ground and the skies are very clear. Looks like in Arizona. Difference that that is snow, not sand.